I got a plan. You always got a plan. This is a good one. Okay, so I was just scrolling through the internet and I found this video and in short, this is what made me pick up Tears of the Kingdom again because I wanted to recreate this. By the way, I'm pretty proud of myself because I was able to find where the Zika clan member was without even having to look at the map. I literally just looked at the video again, saw the snow in the background and knew exactly where it was going to be. I felt like a geo guesser at one point. Okay, I'm ready to go give this a test run. All right, test number one of the funny bomb. Let's give this a shot. Gosh, Eno, you stinker. Hello, my little guinea pig. Yeah, he's gonna transform and just step back. And, and I completely missed. Okay, I reloaded my save, and this is test number two. And I made sure to mark it directly on the map where the Yiga clan member is so I do not lose them. They're in my line of sights now. They're done for. Whoa! Whoa! This is gonna be <laughs> Whoop, I missed. <laughs> uh, oh well, uh, task failed successfully, I guess. Wow, it has been a little while since I've been back in the lands of Hyrule. I'll tell you straight up, no, I have not updated my game, and I'm still on either 1.1 or 1.2, whatever this game is on. I still want to keep my funny glitches because breaking games is the best part of gaming. I've completed so many things in this game since beating Ganon. I've been building up the statue area. Sorry, dude, I need to get a photo of you in your second phase, so I need to get you down as quick as I can. Nah, the lighting isn't good enough. We need to do another- Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Never mind, I guess it works. He- he wouldn't let me get another photo. He was too antsy. I've been doing Korok challenges, but I decided to stop because I hate the Korok challenges. <laughs> The big thing I've done was I've gotten all of the shrines. So I got all 38 hearts and I'm as strong as I can get. Also, my final prize for completing the shrines was a furry costume. 10 out of 10, it gives you a tail. After doing a lot of the base game content and getting kind of bored with sending Koroks to the moon, I decided I should try doing the cool glitches that have been found in this game. I had one clip of a glitch I did in the game at the beginning of my first video, but here I completely break the game and the glitches in the game are even better than Breath of the Wild. Heck, that's not the only one I was doing. Go back into my videos you can see me abusing the duplication glitch so many times i just wanted to make this compilation of funny moments and cool glitches that i found while playing the game on my own since beating ganon no i don't know how to build armor cores but i do have a magic carpet i can show you the world. this is fine <laughs> side note this might be my last video for tears of the kingdom but if you guys like it then i'll post more in the future but for right now i just have some funny clips of me messing around with kilton making statues and basically becoming the most overpowered person in hyrule have fun i'm back at ganon's lair i'm gonna try and use some zonai devices to beat him da, 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 there you go attack my pretties useless machine Yes, I know, these are a lot of bombs, but I have an explanation. Do you see the bananas over there on the ground? Um, those three trees are Yiga clan members, and, uh, I don't want to be surprised, so I'm just gonna blow them up before they can even get the jump on me. You think you can trick me with bananas? What do you think I am, a monkey? Okay, so you know those big Bokoblin bosses that are being followed by the little Bokoblins? So I guess if you get rid of him, the rest of his little Bokoblin squad are basically gonna scream out and cry because he's missing. Bye-bye! Oh my god, it's true! Oh, well, now I feel like a dickhead. Ah, well, not my problem. And we got Zelda over there just, uh, chilling in the sky. Wait! <gasps> Double, Double rainbow, rainbow oh in god. Tears of the Kingdom. I found a better way to catch horses, watch. And now that he's frozen and can't move, I can just easily break the ice and mount him. You killed him. Oh god, oh god, please, please don't tell the horse god. I've been trying to get this recall flying glitch to work for like a day now, and it's just so damn hard. Cause you gotta like time it perfectly. Okay, that should work. Hey, 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 we have liftoff! Another happy landing. 
Okay, so you know about this like item magic carpet ride glitch, right? So this glitch has the same effect yet It's a whole different process first grab out a wing or any flat object that you can easily stand on next Place it next to these two NPCs at this specific stable on the map Make sure by the way before you talk to them that you are standing on top of the item that you placed down before For some reason this conversation messes with the hit detection of the object you stand on So while you're talking to them the game thinks that the platform that you are on doesn't exist anymore Lastly, you attach a small item to the object you stood on. Once you do all of that, you stand on the platform and you can take flight. For what I've seen, this is only available on 1.1.1. That's a lot of ones, which is the version I've been on this whole time. I can't confirm this, but I believe this is the only time in the game you can do a glitch like this. So if you're on 1.1.1 and you want to do this glitch, I recommend doing a save right beforehand. All right, enough with all the technical stuff. Obligatory Green Goblin reference. I uh, think it disappeared for good. And I forgot to save, so I kind of just wasted that. Okay, now on to my favorite two glitches in the entire game. I'll say right now, I found out about these glitches from Small Ant's video, but I'm not sure who discovered them first, so I'm sorry, I don't really know that. But anyways, so the glitches are the Zuckle glitch and the Food Ability Buff Swap glitch. I'll go into some detail, but again, this is for 1.1.1, so unless you can get an old update, these glitches may not work, but I'll still share. The Fabs glitch is easy. Just have a meal with a buff attached to it. Make sure it's the last meal in your inventory. Go to a shop with roasted food, eat the meal, buy the roasted food, and then the buff is attached to that roasted meal that you just purchased. Since roasted meals can be stacked, you can easily keep an abundance of hearty roasted bananas. All right, so that was the easy glitch, but here is the big one. The Zuggle. Oh boy, let's just say lore accurate link is a possibility if you can pull this off right And I'm pretty sure you all know about the zuggle glitch by now when you go into the shrine and mess around with the walls Dropping items and messing with your save files going back and forth from the beginning of the game to the current save You can make a powerful master sword that can and will never break I'm gonna be honest I'm not in the mood to explain the complex process of this glitch because it involves putting giant rocks against walls Dropping all of your items creating a new game and making sure you don't lose your auto save file so that you can do it right as well as doing fast button presses so you can stack stores on top of each other There's a lot to the Zuggle glitch. Like I said, small ant has got the info I'll say this if you want to experience the challenge and difficulties of this game I do not recommend doing this glitch because if you do the bosses won't stand a chance and I'll prove it Here's a compilation of all the gliox and linos. I killed to prove how broken the sword is. Let's kick it All right, who's next? Bro, I'm pretty sure I could just break these rocks in one hit with my Master Sword. <laughs> Told you that was easy. All right, guys, enough messing around, okay? This is a King Gleok. This is one of the hardest bosses in the overworld, so I gotta take this very serious. Tiger, 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 tiger. That only took six hits. Skill issue. I've already moved on to the Lynels. This is gonna be so quick. That's the personal kid! <laughs> I counted seven hits right there. I am going to fuck these Colosseum Lynels up. By the way, do you hear how loud the humming is from the sword? It's insane. This is the weakest Lynel, so my best guess is gonna be three hits. I have officially broken this game. Triple kill. <laughs> this is so much fun! I haven't had a chance to fight a Mulduga in a minute. They're pretty tough, so I don't expect them to go down that easily. Oh! Oh! Oh my god, I feel bad. I thought... I thought you were stronger. Alright, one last little experiment. We're gonna go try and kill Ganon with this glitch sword. Okay, wait, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I'm gonna go kill Ganon. Again. Hey, this might not even work, and it might just do the same damage as I did when I fought him last time. Either way, doesn't matter. I'm coming for that ass, Ganon, okay? I'm coming on your ass. Yeah, you better win your fight, because I'm coming on your ass, boy. I'm coming for that ass. This is such a bitch move from Ganon, by the way. Just making me fight all of his co-workers. Okay, I'm here, you little petty bitch. Give me your best shot. Ah! Okay, then! Okay, so he's under half health, but that doesn't really mean anything because, um, he kind of takes the same amount of damage as he would if the weapon wasn't zuggled. 
Ow, whatever. I'm still gonna kill him anyways. Get over here, you son of a bitch. I downloaded your fucking moveset, you son of a bitch! God, man, you're so overdramatic. Dude, even when I'm shooting the arrows, the sword is still in my hand. Like, it looks like I'm using the sword as an arrow. Nice guy. Ow, 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 ow. Okay. I wasn't gonna waste doling up my sword to hit you, bro. Taking the arrows. All right, we're done. Let's just let's just skip through the cutscenes. Come on, just skip, 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 skip. skip. Wait, what the fuck is that? Oh my! Oh, he still has the sword in his hand. <laughs> oh, that's genius. That's genius. I'm coming for you, dude. Hold on. I just gotta, just gotta catch up. Hey, Zelda. I know we're falling thousands of feet from the sky, but do you want my sword? Here, here, take it. Oh my god, he still has the sword in his hand in the cutscene. I love this game so much. I don't have like an outro for this video, but if you made it all the way until the end here, thanks for watching. I hope some of these clips made you laugh, and um, I'm gonna go ride a bear now. I didn't know there were bears in these woods.